uh, our second game after uh, we had a a good result at home, a good opener, and uh, very excited to see the boys uh, get many things right. At the same time, with a lot of challenges that we all have at the first uh, game of the season, trying to improve them. And looking forward to a match in Chicago against a good team with a new coach and uh, certainly a good footballers that uh, had a good game also in their visit in, in Miami. So our expectations are uh, always the same, trying to go and five for those three points. Um, for sure, players feel the same, that we can go there and keep competing and adding points in this early stage of the season. We recognized uh, Arisco as a good striker in the league. He has done a good job on his uh, years in Philadelphia. And a striker that uh, needs services, for sure, with uh, wingers like uh, Ivanov uh, and Herbert uh, can can provide those services. And, and uh, even his new signing on Shakiri. Shakiri uh, is a very crafty guy. Uh, winger, the fullbacks that go into. So we will, will have that in consideration. This is a game, you know, this, one of their strengths, we will, or we are aware of that and we try to train the way we have done it in terms to control those, those things that Chicago brings. Well, first, uh, it's, it's good to have uh, these players that has uh, choose to come to the league and, and uh, bring the best of their football. I think it raised the level for sure. Uh, we are also aware of uh, the quality of uh, Chakiri that uh, that he had in the in the, in the prior uh, teams. He, he has been with a young, young players like we have now. It's just about um, uh, having that experience and 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 keep uh, uh, see where we are. And what are the things that we need to get better? But uh, Cesar, Andres, the players that you mentioned, Sebas, uh, young players that certainly will, will, will be proud to play against a, a good caliber team and caliber player like Shakiri. And then, of course, we're trying to get the best out of the game for us and, and, and beat him. It is important, it is good news. Uh, to have the presence of Pato and, and, and Archon too, uh, uh, I think have the availability for uh, such strikers right now. It just makes us a better team. I'm happy as well to see Pato being healthier. Uh, we were not lucky last year on that aspect, just missing him for almost the whole season. But uh, his commitment with us and with the team stay there. And I'm really uh, happy to see him scoring already in the first game. And uh, and just by his time, just to adjust uh, Archon into your system and, 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 and the lifestyle here in Orlando. He's doing a great job as well on trying to speed those things up with us. And we're happy to have them both. Hi, good afternoon, Profe. Um, in the home opener, uh, we saw Ruan and Facundo linked up on the right wing and Benji and Pato on the left. Is the expectation uh, for Orlando to attack on the wings to disrupt Chicago's back line? Right, it could be something natural for us. Um, could Ruan give us that opportunity now that we have Facundo? But also we have trained it uh, during the week, Facundo on the, on the left. Uh, we had tried as well to uh, have different sequences in, in our left side. So it will be our responsibility to uh, have a group that has more uh, 
um, tools and have more sequences or distinct sequences. But uh, indeed, Ruan and, and, and anyone in this case, Facundo, as they did last year, last uh, game, I think it was a, a, lot, a lot of good stuff there, you know, uh, combinations and, and, and as we did it in the left, uh, sometimes with Benji and Mauricio and Joao when he's ascending. Well, we tried to combine that, just uh, reviewing how was the structure of the other teams. We'll, we'll keep doing that. Uh, it, it, is, um, it is good that we are patient the guys that had had some uh, sort of problem, whether it was uh, a visa difficulties, they're coming back to the country or needed to be back and forth uh, during the last two or three weeks. Uh, it is important that those players recognize that uh, we understand that this is part of the process. Uh, we're not demanding them uh, they have to be 100% right now. I think it will be very unfair. Uh, they understand that it's a process and we're, we're good to have them. Uh, in this case with Darshan and, and Junior, who has been here already, but had some difficulties with his knee during the preseason. I thought it's a good opportunity to see Andres and Pato, who has been waiting now uh, a good moment to be part of the group and that make us stronger. So don't have any doubt that these guys that you mentioned, uh, Junior, Arkan, Sylvester, these guys are going to contribute to the team in the way we have been expecting. It's not, that's not doubt that they will, but it's good to have the other ones too in a good production and then just give us that and just give it some variations within the, the field and the games. And, we're excited. So, but they're fine. Archon is good. He's full. Uh, junior also, also. So they're ready for selection. And I think for any team in any league, it makes a huge difference when you are a good visitor. Uh, it's something that may not be explained. That makes sense why normally in the whole world, is not the same when you play it at home and, and when you play it away. There is some elements there. There is some things that, uh, that, that, that make you feel like a your way, you know, in spite of you are all the time talking about just being aggressive and having the intentions to get the results and having this initiative. As much as we preach that, it's normal that in any team, in any league in the home games are different or away games and but we definitely we won't we want to be that group that are thinking you will want to win things we have to be strong in our games away and i think in the last two years we have done it we have uh, had a good games i would like the team to feel that uh comfort and that uh initiative as i say and and responsibility to get the points away. It's going to be a very important. It's going to be a different maker, difference maker, the team who can win at home and away in, in the same manner, you know? Bringing points from Chicago for us will be fantastic. And that's, that's our, our thought. Contra Montreal, vimos un Orlando jugando con doble seis, eh, presionando alto al rival por los 90 minutos. Todos ayudaban en la recuperación del balón. ¿Será ese el plan defensivamente contra Chicago, dado que tienen a jugar como Chris Vilco, 12 goles, y Shakiri también, que viene de Liverpool? Sí. Para nosotros es muy importante eh, mostrar una, ca una cara ofensiva siempre, que podamos ver un equipo que tenga la iniciativa de ganar el juego, que tengamos valentía a la hora de competir. Pero al mismo tiempo, uno cuando juega de local o de visita, sabe que en algunas partes del juego tendrá que defenderse bien. Defenderse en cualquiera de los tercios del campo. O sea, que te defiendes presionando, te defiendes haciendo un buen tercio medio, donde 
se, se ve al equipo sólido. O a veces, aunque no nos guste, estar en un bloque bajo porque el rival nos llevó ahí a esas instancias. Y ahí tienes que ser muy resolutivo también y defenderte bien. Lo más importante es que podamos madurar el equipo en el control del juego. Control de la pelota, sí, pero control del juego. En eso es una de las grandes tareas que tenemos. Pero no, no tenemos ninguna duda de, de tener la iniciativa de ir a Chicago con los deseos de ser un equipo robusto, fuerte, que vaya a ganar a Chicago los puntos.